everyone, it's Kristen and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. So for today's video, we are going to be going over some new information and tea on Adopt Me and some upcoming updates. So of course, as always, make sure to give today's video a very, very big thumbs up and make sure that you guys are subscribed with notifications on and let's go ahead and get started. excited about this because I know that Adopt Me has kind of been a little bit slow with updates and a long time ago you guys probably remember we used to get updates every single Friday in Adopt Me. It was so exciting every Friday sometimes literally I would have to stay up until 3 a.m. <laughs> so it definitely has been a nice break to kind of have my Friday nights back but I definitely miss all of the hype and excitement around Adopt Me on Friday night. So it sounds like we are getting ready to kind of gear up into some very very exciting updates here in adopt me and they actually did a twitter post that we are going to be covering where they kind of discussed what to expect and it actually sounds pretty exciting so with all of that said you guys let's head over to twitter and we're gonna spill some tea Okay, you guys, so we're going to be going over their new Twitter post, and I wasn't sure if I was going to cover this, but then I remembered some of you guys are either not allowed on Twitter or you just don't use it. So, of course, I do want to continue keeping all of you guys in the loop and informed. So, Adopt Me tweeted out that they are working on a bunch of exciting updates right now. Thank you so much, or thank you so much for your patience. We know that you have been waiting for the fossil eggs for a while now, but trust, it will be worth it. So yeah, it's it's been a minute, you guys. <laughs> like I said, we used to get those updates. They were coming in like a mile a minute. It was so fun and exciting, and we just really don't get too much. So it does seem like we are getting ready. It is starting to be like the fourth quarter of the year. We have dinosaur fossil eggs that are coming. We also, fingers crossed, are gonna be getting something for Halloween. If you guys don't remember, or if you wasn't playing, we had a ginormous Halloween update. It lasted a whole entire month, and we was able to get a ton of new pets and a lot of really other fun and exciting things. So hopefully the dinosaur, like the fossil eggs, I always say dinosaur, you guys, but hopefully the fossil eggs, they are not going to be considered the Halloween event. But um, yeah, so they say, we are working on a few exciting updates right now. The fossil egg. This update is taking a little bit longer than we expected, and that is because it's just not the egg. We are working on an exciting event to go with its release, and there may also be more pets than any other of the previous eggs, with all completely unique animations. Okay, this excites me. <laughs> so it sounds like this is going to kind of be treated like the Halloween event, but it is going to be for fossil eggs. So normally when we get new eggs, they come to the nursery like the jungle eggs, the current Aussie eggs. They go over in the gumball machine, which I do love that. I think it's cute. And we're going to actually be getting an event. So this is going to be fossil eggs. So it's gonna be like um, pets and stuff that are no longer like, they're kind of extinct, unfortunately, like the dodo. And I have seen some other leaks on Twitter about some possible like mammoths and stuff. So that is really cool. And even the pterodactyl and stuff like that. So do you guys think we are going to be getting some type of like digging? I don't know what it's called, like fossil digging excavation type of event. That would be really cool. Like we have so much extra space on the outer shell of Adopt Me. Wouldn't it be really cool also if we were able to teleport to like a new world map for like these type of special events, but where would it go? Last year, it actually transformed from the Halloween event over where the playground was. 
But I mean, we have so much space. It definitely should be where um, the soccer net is. <laughs> Which pets do you guys think we are gonna be getting? Normally we get, I think like 12 pets. So it seems like we are gonna be getting the most pets ever with the fossil eggs. I really want that dodo pet, you guys. And okay, so let me know in the comments what type of event would you guys like to see brought with the fossil egg update? I do like that they are gonna be including more than just the eggs, so it will give us more things to do and just kind of have more fun during like Adopt Me days. So next they say that trading improvements and scamming prevention is being worked on. Okay, so this excites me, you guys. <laughs> so you probably remember a long time ago, one of the players of Adopt Me actually created one of the kind of like new and improved um, like prototypes for the new screen where it gave us more options to add. As of right now, you can only trade four items. You cannot trade for cash and the cash registers are actually disabled in Adopt Me. So it sounds like we are going to finally be getting the trading update that we have been begging for. More items to help prevent scammers where they say um, like trust trades if you've ran out of space or if it's for money. So it does sound like you are finally going to be able to trade your Adopt Me box as well. And next they say that they are working on a brand new soundtrack. So it sounds like we are going to be getting some new music. I don't really play with the Adopt Me sound to be honest. <laughs> and they also say that they are working on a brand new new quality of life improvement. So that sounds really, really cool. So you guys might be like, what does quality of life improvement mean? So it just kind of means that life here on Adopt Me, I think is going to be better with like more things to do and fill your time. Maybe we can even earn more money and just like more quests and tasks to do. One thing I'm hoping you guys is that we're going to have like fridges and stoves that work and maybe we'll be able to like use our own needs instead of only have to um, deal with pets. <laughs> okay, so last what they say is we are making sure each of those updates is the best that it can be for our amazing community, which means taking more time to make them. It is also important to us that each member of the Adopt Me team is taking care of their physical and mental health during these difficult times, which can cause additional delays. And we hope that you are doing the same. Okay, so you guys, I think it is getting ready to get time to get hyped for some upcoming updates for Adopt Me. Sounds like we are gonna be getting those fossil eggs, trading, and a lot of other super exciting things in Adopt Me. So of course, as always, if you guys enjoy my tea spill videos and discussion, make sure that you guys are subscribed with notifications on. Give today's video a very, very big thumbs up, and hopefully I will see you all next time. Bye, guys.